YouTube, what is going on? My name is Kevin the Tech Ninja, and today I have two quick case reviews for you by the company Oblique. And these are the Galaxy S5 cases, the Skyline Pro and the Extreme Pro. Let's take a look. All right, the first case we're going to take a look at is the Skyline Pro. Now, this case comes in a lot of different colors. I chose the tealish greenish color. Now, the back of this case is sort of slick. As you can see, my light is reflecting off the case. And it also has a line going down the side of the case for a bit of style. Now, it is a two-part case, and the back part of the case is hard, and the other case is a tough rubber case. Now this rubber case does contour your phone pretty well and also the cutouts on here are pretty good. Now the bottom cutout is pretty aggressive and it's pretty large so it's not super precise. Now the buttons do have a nice styling to them. They're actually more of a, uh, a rectangle than just normal squares and they are also cut on an angle. So it actually does give it a bit of styling to it. Um, the case isn't really that bendable since the back is so hard but it will protect it from a drop I will presume. Now I think the Extreme Pro and the Skyline are pretty much the same case, but the Extreme Pro has a more aggressive pattern on the back. It looks like metal and uh, it actually looks pretty cool. It looks like something like a transformer or anything like that. Now this too is very reflective as you can see from the video and all the cutouts are the exact same. These two cases are pretty much the same, um, but just the material on the back looks different. Um, we have more of a me metallic looking material, but it is the same material. So it's not really much difference between the two cases, just depending on what styling you like. Now I prefer the Extreme Pro over the Skyline Pro just because the back has that metallic looking feel to it. It actually, like I said before, it looks like something out of Transformers. It's a very aggressive look. And now the version that I have is more of a gunmetal versus like a pure black. So they have a lot of different colors you can check out. The links are down below. And there you have it guys. That was my quick review of these two cases. Now I feel that these two cases are pretty good and they actually do the job of protecting your device. Now it just depends on this is the style of case that you want. Now with it having to raise the bumpers on the back, you can assume that your lens will be protected in the event of a fall or if you're just setting it down, it does raise your device up just a little bit for that extra layer of protection. As always guys, my name is Kevin the Tech Ninja you can find me on YouTube and on Google Plus and make sure you subscribe to my channel have yourself a great day and I'll see you in the funny papers peace